Hey YouTube, what's going on? Mr. Ubertator here. Um, just thought I'd give you guys a, up, or a, a review of yesterday. Um, went to the pipe show yesterday. I uh, got there about 9.30. Uh, Piper McGee and Eric, uh, who's your pipe guy, were already there. Um, met up with them. We walked around, looked at all the tables and everything. Um, for the most part, it's a bunch of companies that come out of state and have the tables, but uh, Smoker's Haven, which is here in Columbus as a tobacco shop, uh, they had the table. Uh, Missouri Meerschaum was here this year. That was a first. They've never been there before. And uh, PipesAndCigars.com was also there yesterday. Uh, they've never been there before, or at least when I've been there. I've been about the past three or four years, and they've never been there before. Um, they gave out a bunch of free tobacco samples of uh, their new uh, smoker series that they're releasing. Uh, Scandinavian Tobacco Group was there. They haven't been there before. Um, they were giving out free samples too. Um, and then Cornell and Deal was there. They've been there the past couple of years as long as I've been there. They've been there and they always have. They don't do free samples but they bring a huge amount of tobacco and sell it to people. Um, so that was some of the groups that were there. Uh, I met up with Sean, Freedom to Ignite, first time I met him. Great guy. Uh, we talked, had a pipe. Uh, we went and got lunch together at a delicious restaurant in Dublin. It's called Cinco. Um, it's kind of like Chipotle. So it, it was really good. I don't know if any of you have had Chipotle. I think that's only in Ohio and I think Colorado is the other state. So scratch that but it's a burrito place and you like uh, pick your meat beans and they got like fried rice or white rice and you pick that and put in like salsa and like cheese and they roll it up for you so and it's like it's about yay big so I mean it's good size I mean it's probably like size of the water bottle but you know rounder so I mean it's good size burrito um, delicious and I think he said the guy grows uh, all his own herbs there, so that was really good. Um, when we got back, uh, Boontar and Skipsy ended up coming up, so we saw them. Um, Eric Austin Lee was there, talked to him. I think it's Eric Austin Lee. I'm sorry if I got that wrong, Eric. Um, there was another guy who's locally from Columbus. I don't know if he's on YouTube. But uh, he's been to Caps before. I talked to him for a little bit. Um, those are all the YouTubers I can remember who were coming. If I left out anybody, I forgot. But you know, we all had a great time. Um, talk, walking around, and looking at things. Uh, so it was a good day yesterday. Oh, and then uh, after the pipe show, I went and met up with uh, Debo to Zombie. Met up with him at Pipes and Pleasures up up in Columbus. Uh, first time I went to that shop, um, pretty good shop. They have a nice selection of different tins and stuff. Um, so it was great going there. Uh, so met up with him. He's a really nice guy. Um, super nice. Met up with him and his girlfriend. We talked um, with my cousin went with me. So we all talked and smoked a pipe, uh, shooting the breeze. So that was really good. Oh, also met up uh, I met Briarbird on Friday at Smoker's Haven, who had my favorite, made my favorite pipe that I smoked, and then met him again on Saturday. Super nice guy, super super thankful for all the business we get him to. Stellar guy. It was really nice to meet him. So uh, he's super cool. Love all the work he's doing, and it was really nice to finally, you know, actually meet the man that made my pipe and talk to him for a little bit. So that was also cool. Uh, he has some really nice pipes, and uh, Boontar was. Uh, he got a Hoosier pipe guy to buy a, buy a Briar Bird pipe. You know, kept egging him on, peer pressure, and uh, finally got him to pull the trigger and buy a pipe yesterday. And then uh, a couple months ago, Boontar came up to Columbus, is probably back in February or so. And uh, I tried a little bit of snuff. I mean, he had it, and it was a uh, it was called, it's like dark Kentucky or something like that, and it was a clove snuff. Uh, tried that. It was okay, and then, you know, I just didn't do enough to get the effect of it. And then yesterday, I, I'm sitting there looking at the pipe, and all of a sudden, I just hear him go, <sighs> turn around, there he is, doing snuff, and he's like, mind if I have some? He's like, no, sure, go ahead. And did some snuff yesterday, and then uh, now I've 
officially placed my first order with Mr. Snuff uh, last night after I got home from the show. So I broke down and ordered a couple of the different things to try, um, different varieties. I ordered a, like a cinnamon, and then I ordered a bubble gum, and then I ordered like a chocolate mint, and just, um, I think I might have ordered just a regular mint too, I'm not sure. I can't remember everything I ordered last night. It was six tins maybe of snuff that I have coming in. I'll do a yabo once I get those in, and we'll go from there on that one. Um, don't know if I'll like all the ones I get or not. We'll find out. Um, but anyways, another reason I wanted to make this video is what I love about you guys in the pipe community. Even though I was away for like six months and I didn't make any videos, I continued to get subscribers for my videos I had. So uh, thank everybody, thank you to everybody who's been subscribing to me and watching my videos. Um, and so I'm officially over a hundred subs. I mean, it, 110-ish or whatever, so um, now I will officially start my 100 plus subs contest today. Um, and this one's really easy. There's only two rules, I think the same as my last one. Rule number one, you have to be subscribed to me to be in the contest. It's only fair. Um, and two, it has to be a video response again. But this one's pretty simple. Um, just all I want is you to do a video response and explain to me how you got your YouTube name. Um, that's all there is to it. Like mine, Mr. Uber Tater. Um, in high school, one of my friends was, because my real name's Taylor, one of my friends one day was just like, I'm going to start calling you Tater. I'm like, sure, go ahead, why not? And so for usernames, you know, the name Tater by itself, that's a nickname a lot of people have. So, you know, for like a username online or anything, you can't just use Tater. So, I decided to put an Uber in front of it, so it's Super Potato, and then um, that was already taken on YouTube, so I used Mr. Uber Tater, because I'm a guy, so um, that's how I got my YouTube name. Um, maybe some of you, it's just your actual name, so you just say, hey, it's my actual name, so I mean, pretty simple, straightforward, you know, uh, gives us a little insight on some of you YouTube guys. Uh, I don't know, maybe like Devo to Zombie, maybe he likes zombie stuff, so that's how he got his name, I don't, I'm not sure. Um, so, that's all you have to do for my contest, just remember you gotta be subscribed to me, and it has to be a video response to this video. Um, just tell me how you got, you, how you came up with your YouTube name. Um, the contest will go from now, which is today, August 25th, until September 14th. I think it's about three weeks so that's actually on during the pipe show actually so I guess it'll end if some of you are in Nashville it'll end then so you know there you go just so there's my hundred sub contest guys so uh, hope a lot of you guys enter um oh prize pack duh you're like what am I gonna win if I enter a contest I'm an idiot I'm sorry um I think I'm just gonna do either you can pick like smokingpipes.com or pipes and cigars and I'll do probably about 25 bucks and you know um, it'll be a random winner I'll just randomly draw I'm not gonna pick favorites on YouTube name so it'll be random drawing on whoever wins and it'll just be about say about a $25 order or so on uh, smoking pipes or pipes and cigars or if there's another pipe tobacco website that you want to buy from um, I guess that'll buy you a couple tins I'd say maybe three or so tins so that'll be the winnings for it is just an order from website we'll figure it out whenever we get there and uh, I guess if you want if I don't like my snuffs that I get in maybe you can have those tins too if you'd like them um, just depends if I like them so don't hold me to it because I may enjoy them and use them myself uh, but that's another possibility or I guess um, I can go to like Smokers Haven they have a couple of unique blends that only they have. If you want to need to go to Smoker's Havens and pick up some of their tins, I can do that. Um, so, I mean, we can just talk and work it out. So, there you guys go. That's the prize package for my contest. Um, so, hope to see a lot of you guys enter. So, just remember once again, must be subscribed, must be a video response, and it's just how you got your YouTube name. Alright guys, take it easy.